Hi everyone, my name is Lily and I'm here with a few of your favorite FCKC players. Hi, I'm Yael Averbush. I'm usually a midfielder, but now I've turned into a defender. Hi, I'm Erica Timrak. I play left mid for Kansas City and this is my fourth year. What is your most embarrassing moment while playing soccer? Uh, my embarrassing moment, uh, I don't have like a certain one, but I like trip and fall a lot. Like I'm really good with my feet, but sometimes it like backfires and I'll completely trip over myself. Um, and people like don't really know what to say. They kind of just stare at me and I awkwardly get up. Um, but I guess my clumsiness. Um, I remember my most embarrassing moment. This, a, a coach of mine, um, had been inviting me to play up on this women's team when I was 14 and he got mad at me for something I did and so he said I can't I can't play you on this team anymore so I thought in my head oh he's not gonna put me in the game but I'll show him I'm gonna show up at practice and work really hard so I came to the next practice and I worked really hard I was so nice to everyone and he did the whole practice and then after he pulled me aside and he said no I think you didn't understand you're actually off the team <laughs> so I was so embarrassed that I misunderstood him and I showed up. It was a bad moment. Is there anything that gives you some like inspiration or when you're playing against the best of the best? Yeah, I think, you know, every every game we play, we're facing some of the best players in the world at what they do. And I agree with Erica. I think that it's about recognizing what we bring to the game individually and as a team and what makes us some of the best players as well. So I think really it's a lot of it is mental because when you're playing against someone who's the best at what they do and you're the best at what you do, it's about trying to bring out your strengths as much as you can and being confident in the fact that, um, that you're there for a reason and that you can compete against that player and you know, get the better of them. So I think that's huge. It's just being confident in yourself and what you do. How important is your nutrition during the off season and during the season? Now that you know, I recognize how important nutrition is. I drink a protein shake after every practice, workout, um, and then just eating right, putting the right foods in your body, um, clean foods, and drinking a lot of water. It's important, and it's really going to get you to the next level. Yeah, I think nutrition and recovery as a professional player start to be the things that make a huge, huge difference because. As professional players, everyone we're playing with and against is the best at what they do. So it comes down to the little things that you do after the session to get yourself ready for the next session or the next game. And for us, you know, when we've worked really hard on the field, having um, a protein shake or something right after training is really important to recovery. And sometimes, you know, we can't immediately have a healthy meal ready for us right after training. So it's great to be able to grab um, a drink that will hydrate and help us recover all at once. So it's. It becomes the difference maker a lot of times.